Y'all know the reason why? That we're still not the people that we need to be today in love? Tell us, yeah. Now, we know that the first four commandments have to do with the love of y'all. Mm -hmm. And we know that the last six has to do with the love of our fellow man. Yes, sir. And we know that Jesus told us that we need to love our neighbor as what? Ourselves. That's the problem. Because some of you don't love yourself. Did y'all hear what I said? Yes, sir. Some of you don't love yourself. You treat your neighbor just like you treat yourself. Man, I did say something. Ooh. And what he say? He's getting ready to say something now. Everybody, don't, don't y'all forget this. Highlight it. Lodge it in. Lock it in. Look what he says. New commandment I give unto you. Uh-oh. Read. That you love one another. Now, we already know that commandment, right? Mm -hmm. But look what he did. He took it farther. As I have loved you. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. That's it. oh. Now, wait a minute. Don't love each other the way you used to do and formerly do. <laughs> love one another the way that uh -huh. I have loved you. Because y'all is love. Yes. Mm -hmm. Come on. yes sir. See, he's, he's trying to bring us up higher. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Just don't do this thing like this. I want y'all to, the same way I've demonstrated love for y'all. No greater love than this than a man lay down his life for his friend. Love one another the way that Messiah has loved you. You heard the commandment, right? That you love one another. Well, look at this. Look at this. You heard that. As I have loved you. Not just this little thing, love your brother, love your sister, love everybody else. The love has got to be on the Messiah level. It's got to be on that y'all level. Yes, sir. See what I'm saying? Yes, sir. He's bringing us up to the, to the zenith of love, right? Yes, up, all the way to agape up here. And then he turns around and says, well, after he says that, he says, look. That you also love one another. You can't love one another until you understand how the Messiah loved us. Yeah. Once you understand how the Messiah loved us and you start loving that way, then you'll know how to love one another. Oh. <laughs> then you'll know how to love one another. Oh. You've always heard, love your neighbor as yourself, but you ain't never took it as far as what was already written all this time, that you love one another as I have loved you. Now, and, and look, that you also love one another. Once you get that y'all love, once you get that y'all love, and then, then he says, this win, you can be my taught ones. Uh-oh. Read verse 35. By this, shall all men know that you <laughs> are my disciples. What, what, what? If, 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 you have love one to another. Okay, so now, nah, brother, I love you, but I've been frustrated with you. I love you, but I've been bitter against you. Mm -hmm. But you know what? When we love y'all, I've never been frustrated with him. When we love y'all, I've never been bitter against him. I'm coming with real true agape love. Yes, sir. You getting that? Wow. You know, we're very careful about how we present ourselves to y'all. Yeah, that's right. Uh, we just don't yes, sit up and just, just let it all hang out in front of him. You understand what I mean? Yes. We don't have that kind of hatred like that with him. With our brother, we'll demonstrate all kind of hatred. Mm -hmm. But boy, and discord, and disagreement and stuff. But we won't do that with y'all. Mm -hmm. Not when we're full with the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. And then he'll say, this is the only way that people are going to know you're my disciples if you have love mm -hmm. one to another. How are you going to do that? When... You love one another as I have loved you. When you can get to my level of love the way I love, then all men are going to know you're my disciples because that love is different than the love yes, of the world. Sir. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Our love is always uh, based on conditions. Yep. That's right. That's us. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's us. Ooh, everybody doing all right? Yes, yes, yes. like we've seen a ghost in this place, man. Holy ghost. 
Man, but that's beautiful, though. If we can ever get there, we'll be fine. If we can ever get there. I believe we can get there. But we got to die out the selfishness. Because Messiah wasn't selfish. Messiah, though he was rich, he became poor. Messiah divested himself of all divine nature and everything to be able to walk this thing 100% in faith. Trust in Yah. When he was reviled, he reviled not. Mm. That, man, I'm telling you, we, I, I need some work. Yes, sir. Oh, shit. I need some work. When I read something like that, I'm like, oh, Jesus. Yeah. And I thought I loved. Yeah. Woo, boy, I better. Father, I got a whole lot more on my knees and yes. living to do, boy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yep. You know how divine that love is? Jeez. So let's go quote the scripture everybody knows. For y'all so loved the world. There you go. That he gave. Now that means in order to be able to have an agape love, you got to be able to, to give. Yep. You got to be at a and listen. If you get buffeted for your faults, you can't stand up in pride. You got to learn how to take it patiently. For this is the love of y'all. It is. That we keep his commandments. It is. If you love me, mm -hmm. keep, keep my commandments. And my commandments are not grievous. No. That's a lot of love. So guess what? That's There's a lot, lot of people love. playing religion. Don't keep his commandments. You don't love him. Don't give a shit. Deceive yourself all you want. No. Now you think about this. Much as I talk about this, you don't think. I told you. I said it once. I said it a thousand times in the past. I didn't need to say it more. Listen. It ain't the things that I know that disturb me about me. It's the things I don't know. It's exactly. the things that have yet to be unearthed. Yes, that is what troubles me. Yes, sir. And I want to make sure that I'm walking so sober that if something do come up about me, I can catch it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I didn't do all this all these years just so I can just miss the mark, man. I, I'm, I'm on, doing this out of love because I, I, want, I want to see the king. Come on. In the beauty of holiness. Come on. I want my place in the mansion. Yes, sir. Yes. Huh? This is a labor of love. Yes. Come on, teach 1 Corinthians 13. If I speak with the tongue of men and of messengers, but do not have love, I have become a sounding brass or as a clanging symbol. Now in there, right? Come on. And and if I have prophecy and have all secrets and all knowledge, and if I have all beliefs so as to remove mountains, but do not have love, I am none at all. Now mind you. It ain't even saying you cannot do all this stuff. It's saying you actually can do all this stuff. Yeah. That's it. And you still it's don't it. have love. You are nothing. Yeah. Now, in other words, you can have a gift of y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all give the gift, but if you don't operate in love, you still ain't nothing. Yah is so divine that you know what he'll do? He'll let you set up here and be deceived and thinking that you are so damn right and stuff and you are full of all the negative stuff that we speak about, such as unforgiveness, resentment, bitterness, hate, envy, strife, jealousy, all this other stuff. And he'll use you to get somebody else to the kingdom and damn your soul. Don't tell me what Yah is just. Yes, he is just. For every sin and every transgression shall receive a just recompense of reward. You people forget, man, the nature of Yah. You better learn how to walk circumspectly and not as fools. Redeeming the time. So get prophecy. Reveal secrets and knowledge and everything. Hey, got faith. Move mountains. Yet do it because you got the gift, but you don't operate in love. Uh, wow. Unprofitable. Unprofitable. And mind you, the gifts work by love. Mm, mm, mm. For this 
This is the love of Yah. It is. That we keep his commandments. It is. If you love me, mm -hmm. keep, keep my commandments. And my commandments are not grievous. No. That's a lot of love. So guess what? That's There's a lot, a lot of, of people playing religion. Don't keep his commandments. You don't love him. Listen. It ain't the things that I know that disturb me about me. It's the things I don't know. It's yes, the sir. things that have yet to be unearthed. Yes, that is what troubles me. Yes, sir. And I want to make sure that I'm walking so sober that if something do come up about me, I can catch it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And if I give out all my possessions to feed the poor. Now, who have the message preached to us? The poor the does. does. What's the sole purpose of us giving it all? So we can help the poor amongst us. Yes, sir. Isn't that right? Yes, sir. But if I give all my possessions to feed the poor, and what? And if I give my body to be bound? Boy, that's something notable, isn't it? Because yeah. they were burning people back then. Yep. Damn, think about that, man. Getting a body to be burned. Y'all better hope Pastor Dow was there with an arrow to put it through your head or heart. That's mercy. Mm -hmm. Oh, never mind. Yeah, yes, it is. Some people will look, what do you no, mean? If my brother yeah. or sister is burning at the stake and they're screaming in the hall and I put an arrow through their yeah. temple yeah. or their heart, don't that's tell me that ain't. You know, it's something wrong with us, man. No, there is something yeah. sincerely wrong with us today, man. We got a way of thinking, man. It is extremely, not only is it naturally cancerous, but it's spiritually cancerous. And if I give my body to be burned, but do not have love, I am not profited at all. Y'all getting there, right? Yes, sir. You just wasted time. Because you probably got your body burned for your own glory. You want to be a martyr so your name can be wow. remembered. Jesus. You didn't have testimony of Peter. I'm not even worthy to be crucified like mine. Just turn, uh, put me upside down. Because he had the revelation. We need that revelation. Yes, we do. Yes, sir. Verse 4. Love is patient. And then you fly off the handle. Love is kind. But you angry. Mm -hmm. Come on. Love does not envy. But you're full of jealousy. <laughs> Love does not boast. But you are prideful. <laughs> oh, you're prideful, man. What do we oh, do? We need time out over here. We rightly dividing this word too. Yes. You know I'm talking to us, Israel. Yes, Y'all yep. ain't trying to do no perfectus. Per per Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. yes, sir. Come on. Yah is not puffed up. But you ain't got a lick of humility in you. You got that voluntary humility when you know that somebody's gonna reap praises and accolades on you. Okay, hey, 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 yeah. but you're really looking for it. Wow. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Come on. Jesus. <laughs> we got Jesus. Somebody Come say, on. tell the truth and shame the devil. Tell the truth and shame the devil. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Uh, it does not, verse five. Love. Yah does not behave indecently. Come on. Love does not seek its own. How many times have we done that? Mm. You're really seeking your own, but you're trying to get everybody else to buy in what you're selling to make it think it's not your own, but you know in your wicked ass heart of hearts, you're doing it for the benefit of your own damn self. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's why the most high said, you know, he, he judges the yes. thought and the intents yes. of a man's heart. You may try to hide from it. You ain't going to hide from me. I'm, I'm a man of discernment. Discerning the spirits is a gift. And I never use it to abuse. I always use it to draw people close to the king. To be perfect before him. And when I do that, I don't go around and tell everybody, yeah, 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 you know, I told his brother this. <laughs> What kind of damn love is that? Come on. Love is not provoked. It's not what? Provoked. Not but what? Provoked. Some of you at the wind blow, you provoked. Come on. Love reckons not the evil. Come on. 
The <laughs> pastor Reaper said the reset button is yeah. in full effect. Yes, yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yep. Come on. Love does not rejoice over the unrighteousness. Mm. But love rejoices in the truth. It, what, what does love do? Rejoice. Anybody ever had that truth hit you and you go, oh, me, oh, my, and you still yeah. got them hands up? Yes, sir. While you dying at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> While you dying. Anybody ever yes, done it before? Yeah. You, you're, because you, yes, you know, you, if you are a truther, you know it. You know you got to praise him in all things. Yes, sir. And sometimes then it truly, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's a fight and a struggle. Yes, sir. And you still going to fight to give him the glory. Yes, sir. While you die, yeah, hey, some what is he talking about? Ooh, what is Pastor now talking about? I hope some of you get some holiness, man, about yourself. I truly do. Then you ought to understand and comprehend what I'm talking about. I hope you do. You see, look, listen, listen. I know I've at least obtained to this level. I can hear words spoken and still not be offended. You know, I mean, come on. When a man speak, he speak from the heart, right? Out of the abundance of the what? Heart, the mouth, do a speak. I mean, we know that. But the book also says there's a man that speak. And sometimes he slips in his speech. But not in his heart. You have to know the intent of people. Has your heart ever been revealed to you before? Yes, or did, you was like, what the shit? <laughs> the hell is that? Yes, sir. If you ever been there before, surely you can have mercy with somebody else. Yeah, yeah. And you ain't got to say nothing. If you can discern and see that somebody else, oh, they got it. You're, oh, you good if you've been there. If you ain't never been there, you're unmerciful. Jeez. You're unkind. Yeah, you are. You ready to go in like a two-ton heavy stick. Because you ain't never experienced the judgment of y'all against your own self. Ooh. And you know what the judgment, anybody want to know what the judgment of Yah is? Does anybody want to know what the yes, judgment sir. of Yah is? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The judgment of Yah is, is when you judge yourself. Yes, Go ahead. Love covers all. And he what? Believes all. And. Love expects all. And. Love endures all. And, and you know what? You know what's really challenging about all this? So if you are a husband. A patriarch, the head of your family. You're charged to walk in the agape love of Yah in your own family. Husband, love your wives, be not bitter against them. How, how many times we're we bitter against them? They're already weaker vessel. You know they're full of shit. You know they're full of shit. And yet you're charged to love them. First thing you want to do, throw in the damn towel. So suppose the Messiah throwing the towel on your ass. Well, I'm following the law. Well, the Messiah following the law too. So we just got finished reading that love is patient. Love is kind. Love does not envy. Love does not vulnerable itself. I full well expect my Isha's to shit on themselves. I know they're going to do it. But guess what? It's still one. Come on. Love covers. And guess what that one is? <laughs> it's your responsibility. Because you the head. Love covers. I said it's your responsibility because you the head. You can blame her all damn day long. It's still your damn fault. You know how I know it? Because if you're righteous, you're going to catch Eve and rebuke that shit. You're not going to let it ride like Adam did. You're going to set her ass straight. This, this, um, this love that is expected of us. This love has got to go to the Messiah level. We can't no longer just love each other because the commandment says we got to love the way y'all loves. Read it. A new commandment. 
I give unto you. Now let me ask you something. Y'all is already love, right? Mm -hmm. Well, think about it. So did you really give a new commandment though? Since he's already loved. He heard from All him. he did <laughs> was just add steroids to it. Yeah. First command is love Yahweh, your Elohim, with all your heart, all your soul, all your mind, and your spirit. And the second is like unto the first, which is love your neighbor as yourself. Now, you know what y'all just did, right? Y'all want to hear what y'all just did? Yes, yes, sir. He took the first where well, he's supposed to love all of him. Then he took the love that you would normally have for natural man, move that out of the way, and say, You need to love also on this side the same way that I love. Mm -hmm. That way you can come on. Mm. That way you got y'all love on both sides of yeah. it. Come on. Woo! The law. Wow. It's amplified. <laughs> We're gonna move man out of all this shit. Yeah. It's gonna be straight up y'all. All y'all. All y'all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. 